With your storm track weather forecast, I'm meteorologist Crystal Cly. Here's a look at the Canateo game tonight in Lubbock. 59, your temperature at kickoff, 6 p.m., 7, 55 degrees, and by 9 o'clock, 52 degrees. A little bit of fog potentially starting to build by around 9 p.m., and it does look like it'll be a foggy morning Saturday, so do expect that if you had plans to head out back to El Paso early Saturday morning. On your future track model, some clouds starting out in the morning around our region, but mostly clear outside through the daytime. Your lunchtime and your afternoon, just spotty clouds and sun through 6 p.m. Then we roll overnight, mostly clear, partly cloudy, with rain and that cold front starting to edge over Arizona, heading our direction. Here's at lunchtime, still mostly clear, allowing us to heat up on your Saturday back to around 70 for a high in the evening, 7 p.m. Now we start to see that rain moving in with that frontal system, starting out around TRC down to Luna County and then scattering around the central and east parts of our viewing zone by 9 p.m. Now the model skips over El Paso, and I think it is missing us. There is a chance of rain for us here in El Paso and parts of Hudspeth to Culberson County. By midnight, the rain does move off, and it's looking like a more clear forecast for your Sunday. El Paso today, 70 is our high. We're calling for 46 tonight. Just some clouds mixing in with clear skies. Same for Las Cruces, 67 today. Similar to yesterday, mostly sunny, and tonight, a low of 41 degrees. Here's a look at the rest of our forecasting zone 66 TRC, 52 Cloud Crawl, and 60. Eight Van Horn tonight down to 43 there and 37. You're low in Rio So here's our seven day forecast 70 tomorrow. As we mentioned, still warm Saturday, late day, a 20% chance of rain. Windy both Saturday, especially Sunday. And as that cold front passes, look at your forecast 59, our high Sunday into Monday. Overnights are also cooler in the mid 30s through Monday, Tuesday morning.